Welcome to the Sidra Intersection 8 tutorial series. In this video, we'll teach you how to use the Volumes Excel utility for Sidra Intersection. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to tap the bell to receive notifications about our new videos. Volumes is a macro-enabled Excel application that enables the same Sidra Intersection site in a project to be processed using different sets of volumes and related data specified within the Excel file. The Volumes utility provides Volume Output, Intersection Output, Movement Output, Lane Output, and Pedestrian Output data in Excel. These can then be copied and pasted into other applications if desired. It also incorporates a peak flow factor calculator. The Volumes utility requires MS Office 2016, 2013, or 2010 use with macro-enabled Excel file extension XLSM. Before this utility can be used, a licensed version of Sidra Intersection must be installed on a computer and a Sidra Intersection project file needs to be prepared. Volumes and all related documentation can be downloaded for free from our Sidra support site. We have included the link to this download page in the description section on YouTube for this video. Users with knowledge of Excel and Excel VBA programming may customize the volumes utility. For example, batch processing of Sidra sites can be implemented by passing volume data from Excel to a Sidra project automatically. Documents giving technical information are available to help programmers who want to develop API applications for Sidra Intersection. Now let's begin. The first time you open the Excel file, you may get a security warning asking you to enable macros. If the macros do not run on your computer and you do not get any prompt about enabling them, please contact your IT department. Let's take a quick look at the contents of the workbook. The introduction sheet contains information about the features and use of this utility. The license agreement sheet indicates that the use of this Excel utility is subject to the Sidra Solutions license agreement. The control sheet contains buttons to perform the various functions provided by the utility. The volume input sheet displays volumes and related data for various vehicle movement classes and pedestrians. The related data include the unit time for volumes, peak flow period, peak flow factor, growth rate, and flow scale. The volume output sheet contains data that correspond to the demand flow rates used in Sidra intersection analysis. The intersection output sheet displays the intersection performance measures with hourly values. The Movement Output Sheet shows various vehicle movement performance values. The Peak Flow Factor Sheet operates independent of other calculations in the Volumes utility. Now let's learn how to use volumes. To select a site, in the Control Sheet, click the Open Sidra Intersection Project File button and browse for the project file which contains the site you wish to work with and then select the site from the drop-down list. In the Volume Input Sheet, you can now see the table of default input values corresponding to the movement classes included in this particular site in the selected project. To copy across the volume and related data from the selected site, go to the Control Sheet and click the Get Volumes button. In the Volume Input Sheet, you can enter volumes, peak flow factors, flow scales, and growth rates. These are entered for each movement class separately. The output sheets will be populated when you use the Process No Volume Update or Update Volumes and Process functions. 
the process noValumeUpdate function will ignore the data in the volume input sheet and process the site with the original volume data entered in the Sidra Intersection project. Use the Update Volumes and Process button to transfer the volume input data prepared in Excel to the selected site in the Sidra Intersection project and process the site at the same time. The Movement Output Sheet will automatically open when the process functions are used. The Movement Summary is given for vehicles only. Results for pedestrians are given in the Pedestrian Output Sheet. The output sheets are very similar to the corresponding output reports in Sidra Intersection. You can easily copy and paste them into your own reports. The Volumes utility can also be used to transfer the data contained in the Volume Input Sheet to a site in a different project or in the same project. In the Control Sheet, select another site from the drop-down list, or open another project and select the site you wish to transfer data to from the current Volume Input Sheet, and then click the Update Volumes and Process button. Any changes made to the current Sidra Intersection project through processing in Excel are temporary until the Save Sidra Intersection project file function in the control sheet is used. You can also copy and paste vehicle volumes from tables in the volume output sheet to those in the volume input sheet using the copy volume output to volume input function. The Clear function will close the Sidra Intersection project, clear the output sheets, and set the values in the Volume Input Sheet to defaults and hide the Volume Input tables. If you click the Clear button before saving your project, you will be prompted to save or not to save the changes made to the Sidra Intersection project file as a result of the use of this Excel application. The last sheet named Peak Flow Factor is independent of other calculations in the Volumes utility. It includes a graph provided for improved understanding of the Peak Flow Factor concept. Let's alter the Peak Flow Period and the Peak Flow Factor to see their effect on the graph. The Peak Flow Factor sheet may also be used to calculate a Peak Flow Factor from known volume values. This concludes our tutorial on the Volumes Excel utility for Sidra Intersection. You can refer to the Sidra Intersection user guide for more detailed information on the use of the Volumes utility. Thank you for watching.